name's Ross Rudell. This is my exhibit at Bay Heart. It's titled Zero Zero, which is connected to the title piece for the show, which in order to understand that title requires merging those two circles, which is the setup for everything that's in the main space here, where I have anatomically correct representations of male and female interacting, both in a profane and highly sensualized and spiritual way. sunset so that the run up is in the daytime, the run down is in twilight, and then I get to go home and work. When I hike in Joshua Tree, I always hike in big circles. So all of this, it's all integrated into the thinking that's in this show. There was one particular um, hike that I did that I came over a ridge and I looked down and the valley below me was uh, uh, what appeared to be like Stonehenge, uh, these columns of, of granite and in a circle. And I made my way down there and once I broached the perimeter and was inside this ring of rocks, um, everything was different. Um, the vegetation was twice the size of everything outside. Um, the colors were just more vibrant, and, and you know, I was, I was <laughs> um, just intoxicated by it. And I started meandering down the stream, or you know, a, a wash, a dry stream bed. And so I'm going down the stream, and it seemed to just kind of continue a cir in a circular pattern. And in a truly Escher-esque uh, phenomenon, I ended up back, uh, I ended up back where I started that, uh, that turn. And also while I was out there. Um, I came across this. <laughs> a shoe that was desperately trying to be a circle. <laughs> um, and all of this is stuff that, okay, and I exited, and, um, and it was such a, a remarkable experience that I, uh, on subsequent trips, I tried to find the place and never could until finally I found it and it had none of the magic. The rocks were just regular rocks. The circle wasn't a very good circle. Uh, the vegetation was the same, so it was a magic moment out there. Um, and that's what I see when I'm out there. 